Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Scorpio for the month of September. It is a general reading, so it will not resonate with each and every one of you who are watching. Um, if this doesn't sound like your story, check your moon sign or your rising sign. Your messages could be there. If not, check back in the following week when I put out a new message for your sign. So, with our three of coins sitting at the bottom of the deck, this is about everybody being on the same page, I feel. This is what you want. It's what you want to know. Are we on the same page? The challenge for you is in finding out this information uh, as we uh, head towards September and throughout September. This is uh, something that you will be facing. You are particularly uh, vulnerable or sensitive when it comes to this situation because I see that um, there's been some anxiety uh, or a lot of worry. Um, this could be a reconciliation, um, getting back together. And um, so you're very sensitive, very vulnerable here um, in the emotional sector. Um, because it's falling on the card of Pisces. And Pisces is that um, sensitive, very sensitive, emotional type of energy. Um, I feel that... Um, this is all about seeking information, getting to the truth, um, uh, honesty. Um, it feels, the situation feels somewhat risky. Um, but um, you are, you still believe that it could work. What, you know, you're, you're not quite sure of the other person's intentions. Are they on the same page? Again, this is what you're after. You have the seer. The seer tells you to trust your instincts and your intuition and that the truth uh, will be revealed to you. If you follow your intuition, it's like it leads the way. The serpent can be like that, um, a renewal, the shedding of old uh, habits. You don't want any surprises with that serpent being there. You know, it's like the serpent it goes, <laughs> goes slithering through the long grass and you don't really see it till it's too late. That's what you're trying to avoid. It's what you don't want. Over here, we see with this uh, Queen of Swords here, uh, this is a card of an agreement. Um, it is a card of communication, discussions that are uh, open and honest, getting to the truth of things. Um, so this is what you're, what you're wanting, what you're hoping for, is to get to the truth. You believe, see it's here, with the card of idealism um, on, on the wheel. So, you believe here. You believe in pushing forward um, it, it, with this change. Um that it can change and um, the belief is very strong and it's like it gives you the strength to push forward despite the fears that we see over here it 
and it feels you see you're you're up in your head a lot this is this is the central issue it's all these thoughts of loyalty faithfulness um, the plan of moving forward it seems like it's really slow to be able to take it where you want it where you want to where where it might feel more safe and secure um, emotionally and mentally you know um, so there's a um, there's a lot of thought here you're really up in your head with this card of air because the knight of pentacles alone he's already very much the thinker the planner um, with the card of air here that's really uh, emphasizing that it feels like you're sitting on something because again you can't see clearly you see here's the five of cups so you've experienced grief here but uh, at the root you have always desired the spilled cup and you're trying to reach for it but you see how it's just out of this person's reach and it's frustrating because they're not interested in any other cup or any other opportunity it is the one that is out of reach up here or that feels that way that they are after that they desire but they cannot see clearly and so they're waiting very patiently because they still believe they can have this cup with the Eastern Emperor sitting here. The challenge is getting the cup. You see, the Nine of Wands and the Ten of Cups. That is the challenge. And so, all of the experience this person has, uh, they're using all of it to face this challenge. Being very careful. It is struggling. And they have fears. Hmm seven of pentacles um so an error an error has been made here um you could be okay what you're trying to do here because this is covering up an error um but what I think is, it's uh, they're like hiding uh, or covering the fear that they feel. Because they're, <clears throat> remember uh, this card of um, idealism says that they're pushing forward despite the fears. So that's what they're trying to do. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. And yeah, and here's all the fears, you see. They're here. And it feels really chaotic. Cards are just flying everywhere. Yeah. Uh I just saw the next card here. <laughs> 7 of wands. It's it's like it, it and again, you got these cards flying all over the place. It's like it feels like it's uh, insurmountable, like everything is against it, you know? Yeah. And here we have the fears uh, in the Nine of Swords. 
but and we see this is just confirming what I just saw we see that you're so determined you still you believe in this and you're pushing forward with it despite the fears the fears you put them at your back you're riding forward it doesn't mean you're not going to be careful and cautious but you're not giving up either sticking with a decision trying to get this back on its feet to bring back the peace and harmony looking at the cup and um, you've got very deep feelings about healing this and you're willing to you're willing to wait it out for sure faith you have faith that you'll be able to um, have this mm -hmm. reaching for it uh, reigniting the flame strength that comes from the heart I feel like you really love this person um, because the waiting and it's like frustrating it's like it's like it's there but you can't hold it you know it's like it's 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 like this card was saying where is that card oh here it is it's like you can almost touch it you can almost taste it and so it it it's weighs heavy it's like a burden it's like ugh, things are still up in the air but you're putting the effort you're putting in the time and you know what that is going to pay off because you have the stars so this is um, this can indicate a wish coming true um, a journey or the journey that you've been on finally starts bringing in results it brings rewards and you see the next card the talisman you are destined to succeed so for you for whoever um, this resonates it appears uh, as though the effort and time you've put into this um, it's going to bring the reward that you had dreamed of or desired you face a challenge here and it seems like you overcome it I thank you for watching for liking and for sharing my videos and for subscribing and um, also thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation many blessings